Uh, the birds be so loud up in here. Just a little bit. I really hope you can hear it as loud as I can. All right, I just realized I have 54 days till my birthday. And that means I technically only have 50 days to get my body right because those extra four days that I have don't count because I'm gonna celebrate my birthday week. If you leave your birthday up to your one day, that's why so many people don't like their birthday and they just wanna cry. They just end up crying on their birthday because you need to have that week to celebrate. You can have one bad day in that week, but the rest of the week is gonna be good. You have to just, yeah, go hard. I'm gonna have a single, <laughs> a single birthday this year. I was literally gonna tell you that we can't do Starbucks, or if we do Starbucks, we have to get not so sweet. Uh, no. <laughs> okay. My well, drink is only 200 something calories. I don't believe that no. without cold foam. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Yeah, we have 50 days. Right now we're gonna go to Trader Joe's. We have to get our food right, our protein intake right. I am terrible with the food aspect of it. It's either I eat bad things, too many bad things, or I don't eat enough. And so neither of those are good. Neither of those are good for the gains. I also, I'm gonna be sober for these 50 days. No alcohol. These past two weekends have been, um, it literally scarred me to drink for a while, so that's okay. I don't really mind the not drinking part. I just need to stay disciplined. I know that I don't have any motivation. I have like the teensiest bit, but it's not enough motivation. I just need to get that out of my head. I need to stop waiting around to get motivated, and I just need to be disciplined and do it even when I don't want to do it until it comes a habit. That is what we're gonna be doing today. Trader Joe's, Costco, I'll bring you along. You guys know that I have been traveling back and forth to LA every weekend. And honestly, the drive hasn't been bad. What's been bad is this freaking gas. Gas is $5 a gallon still. Sometimes in LA, it's like $5.50. About 70 bucks to fill up my car every time. No complaints, I mean, I'm not paying for rent right now, which is great. Thank you to my parents. Gas has been absolutely ridiculous. But I have been looking at places. Rent is also astronomical, like everywhere. And I'm a little bit nervous for that, but very excited. That's all I have to complain about is still gas prices. Maybe like, nothing. So we're gonna try feta. I mean, don't know if I'm a big fan of it, but I think it tastes like farts. So <laughs> I guess, but it has good protein in the cheese. We love cheese girlies, but the protein farts are not gonna be it. If you don't put your car back, you're a bitch. The take that we just did of me putting the groceries in my trunk was the second take. Uh, I passed the, the camera to Pete and I didn't give it to her recording. So I had to get the car all over again in front of all these people. It's actually pretty packed out here. I know it was my fault, but I had to do a double take. Oops. <laughs> now, we got to Costco. All we really need here is protein things, protein shakes. But we'll look around, of course, and see if there's anything else that we need. Mm. But mostly we're just going, coming here for protein. Yeah. <laughs> so what we got right now. Started off with the Tupperware glass, because plastic is bad for you. Dave's bread. Foam broth. It has nine grams and just eight ounces of this, like a, cup, a little bit more than a cup. Nine grams of protein, zero fat. Chicken breast, 60 cows, and 13 grams of protein for two ounces. Paprika for the spices. Spinach artichoke, 
It's Greek yogurt, and it's Greek yogurt. This is for a little snack. We can't just take everything out of our diet. And now we're just gonna get the protein shakes. No luck. Premier protein tastes like shit, so I don't know if I wanna get this in total. But it's okay, because we're investing in ourselves. All right, we're investing. Another thing that I have to get really good at is drinking my water. I'm terrible <laughs> at getting my water intake in. So this right here is going to be a little stupid thing, but we're just going to chug this water. Three, two, one. <sighs> okay, one down. We got one more to get. Yeah, I can't. <laughs> I'm gonna drown. <laughs> this is the part of my day where I start to crash a little bit. I know eventually I'll have a little bit more energy midday, but right now I've been just trying to listen to my body, pay attention to what my body needs if my body is telling me that I'm tired. Like, my brain is tired, but also my body. Like, I literally don't want to move it either and i know that's just the sadness creeping in a little bit and i don't want to feed into it too much like I, i'm not gonna stay in bed and i push myself out of bed in the morning but if my body's telling me i need a nap i'm gonna take it because i yeah i just get into those moments where i'm sad and sleepy <laughs> but also we've been running around a little bit crazy today so lenient with myself giving myself some grace today <sighs> trying not to nap for too long and then gym is tonight so <sighs> yeah good night it is eight o'clock i'm like <laughs> i can't even open this eye because it has mascara on it i didn't i never want to wash my face i was definitely grinding my teeth definitely had an awful dream definitely don't want to wake up i feel even sadder Remind me to never take a nap again. I need love and attention and cuddles. I feel like absolute garbage. Like I've been fine waking up by myself, but I've always hated naps. Even when I was in a relationship living with someone, like if they weren't in the area when I would wake up, I would freak out. So remind me to never take a nap again, cause I feel so shitty. Anyways. Let me wash my face, got myself together, chug another water. We got this. I'm fine. I will be fine. I'm okay. I just need to, like... Waking up and going to sleep is weird when you're single or freshly single, okay? There's really no explanation for it. Let's go. Ready for the gym. Taking some creatine. I've been good on my water for, like, two days. So I'm trying creatine, and I need to just be consistent with my water because if you are not consistent for drinking your water and taking creatine, yeah, I'm gonna pass out. <laughs> and then, some Oxy Shred. Wait, is that gonna make me sweat? Yeah. You're not supposed to take it together? No, you're not supposed to take it late because then you won't go to sleep. Oh, it's okay, I don't go to sleep anyway. Gonna take some of this. Get your little dry scoop. <sighs> So <laughs> I don't pass out. It's leg day, baby. So last time I hurt my That was stomach. raw. <laughs> We're also gonna just chew on some salt because the pump's gonna hit better and then I'm gonna feel better about myself. I was a little bit nervous to uh, record in the gym. Also, I'm gonna get a mic. But I was a little bit nervous to record at the gym at first because I'm not as big or as a trainer, not someone that works out, not an influencer that works out. We all start somewhere. So here's your motivation. I 
felt like vomiting in the first half. I'm not gonna lie. Ooh, it's so dark outside. I ate like, what time did I eat? Like 30 minutes before? An hour before? I ate in like an hour before, but I kind of stuffed myself. My sister had to push me to eat dinner. And then all the shit I took before. I wanted to vomit a little bit during squats. Push through. We got a really good workout in. I will be better next week, but I'm proud of myself. So we're gonna get home, shower, get her the rest of our protein in, and that's it for today. Plain Greek yogurt, Trader Joe's. Oh. <laughs> Honey one is so good, it tastes like ice cream, but too many calories, too sweet, yeah, too much sugar in that, not good for you, so I got the plain Jane. Alright, 170 grams is 110 calories and 17 grams protein. Then a scoop of protein, 32 grams of protein that we're gonna mix in. But I'm gonna put some almond butter. The only ingredient is almonds, and that is what you need to get because some of them try to trick you and put like five more grains in it, and you don't need all that. And I have a confession to make. Sometimes I don't be washing my produce. Uh, that's just how I was raised, you know? <laughs> I don't really always lived on a ranch and we have vineyards all around us. And we would just pick up from the vineyards and eat our grapes freshly and fertilized. freshly fertilized, dusted over, raisins on the floor. Yeah, I don't wash my produce, that's my, that's my secret. More bugs, more, pr more protein, I guess. <laughs> And this is my late night snack meal. 43, 43 grams. grams of protein um, and under 300 calories. For those that have trouble getting in their protein, mix your Greek yogurt, plain protein powder, get that shit in. And then on top of that, I'm gonna have a protein bar that we got also from Trader Joe's today. This is another 20 grams protein, 200 cal. And that is it for this week's video. Thank you so much for all the love on my last YouTube video. I was very, very shocked by all the comments and just all the views that I got on it, all the likes. Thank you so much for all your support. I keep on going back to the comments and reading them over again. I hope you liked this week's video. I hope it feels like you're watching a YouTube video, but also like a FaceTime call. That is my goal for... <laughs> For the videos to come, uh, just trying to be vulnerable with you guys, being myself, doing all that just, I feel like for you that is watching, you are keeping me accountable and just keeping me on the right track. So thank you and I will continue to try to put my heart out there for you guys and I love you and I truly, truly would not be here without you.